boys. this who's gonna claim it it's frozen now just a minute girls okay have a good day lock is up too many predators around lately We'll keep you turkeys inside. It's too cold today. I mean, he's got to go out to work. is a brisk minus 11 degrees celsius <laughs> yeah just a little cold we got a safety warning um email at work just because of the drop of temperature to uh, be careful on the roads they are wet so that's going to give us black ice something i can't i don't like sorry i was just talking with something on my lip well, breakfast on my lip. <laughs> a good old breakfast pop, isn't that? that breakfast of champions, I always say. <laughs> anyway, so just gotta be careful today and um, keep an eye out for this, the slippery roads and other drivers who uh, think that they're invincible. <laughs> more than minus 11. Oh, warm this baby up. Oh my gosh.
everybody. Welcome back to the channel. Um, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Tammy, and this is Greenwich Hill Homestead. Uh, obviously not at the homestead today though. <laughs> so I welcome the new subscribers. Thank you very much for subscribing. Sub subscribing. <laughs> And uh, thank you for the ones who have continued to stay uh, on board. Um, so welcome. So currently I am working and they seem to be just bouncing me around like a milkshake. <laughs> anyway, just picking up uh, a load here to go back up to uh, well, I guess I can't really say my info with that, but picking up a load, how about that? <laughs> but I've been thinking since I um, was having such a hard time with my computer and getting my files loaded and uploaded and it was just driving me crazy for the last few months. And um, so I have been thinking that a lot of my content from now in the future is going to be just me taking you with me whether it's at work or whether it's on the homestead or whether Joe and I are out doing something together something like that so that way whatever I like the content I get that day I can automatically load it right up onto onto the uh, editing software that I have and get that in there so that I don't lose it <laughs> um, because oh my word you have no idea that the trouble I was having and why I I just couldn't understand I would load the the um, the video into I'd transfer it into the computer and I would look at the file that I put it in and it wasn't there so I couldn't understand what the heck was going on and I went all over all the different files that I had um, different just I went everywhere and I couldn't find it and um, so I think the best thing for me to do right now until I figure out whether I'm going to get a new computer a new yeah probably a new computer because <laughs> um, I don't think it was the camera's fault because the, the file actually mind you I bought a um, shoot the out, outer uh, I can't believe I'm drawing a blank the thing that saves everything that you put it into anyway the files were were there and then uh, I had plugged it in one day to look up see if maybe the files ended up in that in my D drive and it wasn't there so I couldn't understand anything but anyway to say this I said all that to say this that in the future from now on it's going to be just blurps take like video takes of what I'm doing throughout my day whether it's like I said at work at the homestead out shopping out having uh, fun with Joe whatever it's just gonna be you coming along with us just checking to see if that light no nope, the lights not green yet uh, but anyway that's uh, that's what's going to be in the future and I think it's gonna be a lot easier for me to handle the videos and editing them due to me working so much as well if I'm able to get the videos these little you know whether they're 10 second or 10 minute uh, videos it'll be easier for me to get it get it into the editing software and uh, do it that way and then I can easily upload it to YouTube so that way I won't take so long in getting the videos out like that was three months and uh, yeah I don't want to be doing that but anyway so I'm here at work and I'm having fun believe it or not <laughs> who has fun at work <laughs> Tammy does <laughs> um, 
Um, anyway, I'm at work and just uh, it takes me a few hours to get where I gotta go. That's gonna be turning green any minute here, so I can't do any obviously any videoing while I'm driving or anything like that. So you never know, your company could be watching you on YouTube, right? <laughs> so anyway, so we'll see you in the next segment. Good morning, girls. Got a tree. Got a tree for you. Come and get it. And the turkeys. You come out. Chicken stuck in the shed. We do, don't we? You coming out? Did you lay your egg in there? Yeah, let me look. Where'd you go? Where'd you lay your egg, girl? Oh. Okay. Here you go, girl. Here. One of the girls I saved, her beak is a little crooked. Come on, girl, over here. I'm with the rest of the girls. It's quite the paw print. We could have our bobcat back. Hmm. Good morning everyone. Another crisp winter morning. <laughs> oh my word. Feels like again yesterday was minus 10 so today is about the same but not a cloud in the sky and the sun is shining so that makes for a beautiful day. I hope you're having an awesome day. The boys are crowing as usual. <laughs> <laughs> and I just fed the chickens and the turkeys some scrambled eggs. I had some boiled eggs that I didn't get to eating this week. So I just um, scrambled them up and gave them to the chickens and to the turkeys. You gonna go inside? Get in there. Get in there and go. And then I uh, also fed them some oatmeal, dry oatmeal, and crushed up eggshells, and uh, some bread. So, oh, and also I put some blueberries and strawberries that I also didn't get to eating this week. So I just give it to the chickens. So we're not doing too much today, actually. I was going to run into town and pick up a few things that we need. One of them, obviously, is chicken feed. Uh, I shouldn't say obviously, but because <laughs> you guys don't know. <laughs> anyway, I got to pick up some feed, and I also give them uh, sunflower seeds that are hauled and just plain. So um, I'm going to pick up some, some of that. And then probably a few groceries. <laughs> One girl gets picked on by the turkey all the time. She finally got her feathers growing back. For those of you who don't know, my turkey female, she went into uh, brooding. I'm like, you can't be doing that at this time of year, girl. <laughs> so 
So she sat for over, well, a gestation period for a turkey is 28 days. And she was probably like 35 days. She wouldn't give up. I, I would probably stretch it to 40 days. <laughs> but that was my fault for letting her go that long. Uh, but anyway, I got her off the uh, off the nest, and but within that time, she was losing her feathers. So you need the feathers, obviously, for the winter, and I didn't want her too cold. We got a heat bulb, not a heat light, but a heat bulb in the... Look, the cold is making me go red. We've, we've got a heat bulb in the... Uh, in the coops, all the coops, and uh, except for the yellow one, that, that's that's a heat light. But anyway, we've got the heat bulbs in there, and uh, just to kind of, you know, just take take the edge off, I guess. Um, it's not completely, you know, like really warmer or whatever, but it just it does take the edge off of the off the coldness, especially at night when it drops down to really really cold. But anyway, um, we might be doing some more work on the floor of the barn also. Well, Joe is. I shouldn't say we. But I do try to help him as much as I can. Uh, whatever that is. Whatever that looks like. <laughs> so, But other than that, yeah, we're not doing too much today. And it's, a, again, a beautiful Saturday afternoon. Or, well, morning. It's not afternoon yet. But get close. <laughs> no, you can't get her. Sorry, Roscoe. I think I'm going crazy. <laughs> What's going on? Well, hello. You gonna jump down? Pretty girl. What? You're following me. What's going on? Yes. Hi, girl. How you doing? Got your feathers back, I see. That's good. Hello, Fred. Handsome dude. And say hi to everybody. This is a willow tree that we planted uh, last year. We bought two of them. That's the second one, right there. Look at the difference. They're side by side. And how this one is growing so much better. Weird. You hear that? I hear hammering. Let's go see what Joe's up to. Recycle the futon. Yep. <laughs> Recycle the futon. Cut it up. And uh, gonna use it for the bars on top here for the saw. <laughs> that one's already all attached. Can you get better lighting? <laughs> it's pretty solid. <laughs> Oh my gosh, that ain't going anywhere. No. You're in jail. I'm in jail. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh my gosh. Recycle, reuse. This whole barn is. That's good. That's how we like it. 
Yeah. So some of you don't oh. know what? Broken half. What did? Yeah. My ting. <laughs> Your ting? <laughs> My ting. Your brave? I, I, this is a great, great idea too. Isn't okay, it? what did you do? Bring yeah, it to the I, camera. I, I, I cut it with the skill saw here nice and rounded. Uh-huh. Right? Because the futon has rounded edges. Okay. It goes right in there to hold it tight. Isn't that awesome? Mm, isn't <laughs> oh, and I just got a splinter. Oh, no. Sticking in my hand. I can't. Oh, oh then, okay. okay. So one of them just broke on you? Ah, yeah, this one. Yeah, so as some of you don't know, if you're new to the channel, which we've got quite a few new new uh, subscribers, um, so thank you to those people, but um, this is a 24 by 24? Yep. 24 by 24 barn that pole is... Barn. Pole barn. That has been built... Uh, well, the frame we bought, we bought the wood for the frame, so like, yeah, what are barn. they? Yeah, 6 nice. by 6. It's sturdy, but we built the rest of it out of pallets, as you can see. If you look around, you can see everything is <laughs> pallets, right? So, and then the other wood that we've been putting down, he's uh, got the wood from, or I mean, for the floor from a bar barn teardown, and. Uh, Anyway, he got word that there was somebody tearing down the barn and he can come and take whatever you wanted to get. So we went and we got a video on that. So you can go back and check out the uh, the video on that. So but so now he's got this. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> it looks good. You wouldn't know. If you didn't know what it, that, where, like where that came from. And you thought it was a nut when you saw the ad. Saw me talking with somebody for a free futon. Well, I'm like, what does he want a futon for? <laughs> so I get home from work and I'm like, so what would you want that for? And then I'm he tells me. I'm going to put it in my shed just in case you take me out of the house. Yeah, and what was my idea? <laughs> uh, hay feeder. A hay feeder. I thought he was going to take the same... Not a bad idea either. <laughs> <laughs> no, not really. Wasn't too bad. Um, I don't know if it would work for Probably for a would. horse, but as you see, goats or something. But anyway, uh, that was my idea. <laughs> I was a hay feeder. <laughs> Clouds seem to be coming in. Clouds. It was clear this morning. The clouds seem to be coming in. This one that we tore down from the, the other barn in the middle. Oh, so put the two black ends on, or the two black pieces on either end and then that in the middle? Yeah, this one I'll probably have to frame in just like this one is. Uh -huh. I'll just cut those bars out. All right. And actually put them in two by four frame like that. Because it's not gonna it kind of look stupid, so no, that'll work. Or I can put one black, one gray, one black, one gray, one black, one gray. No, no we don't want to do that. No, I didn't think so. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't want to do it there, it's more work. <laughs> no, but that'll work. Nice. Awesome. We got a lot of material from that bar, barn teardown. A lot of material.
even that's fine because couldn't you when you just be uh could you not put this up against that and block it in like you did for that side yeah oh whatever whatever's easier Three inch nail line. I don't know. <laughs> I miss it. So just frame that up and then put the black piece up, right? Huh? Just frame that up and put the black piece onto it? Yeah, I'm gonna have to frame the black piece somehow. I don't know yet. But, uh, yeah, no. Figure it out as you go. Yeah, exactly. <laughs>